Generic greetings, and welcome back to Heat Signature once again. In the previous episode, we almost died. Prix's beard of this character here. Um, we we only have eight seconds of life left in space. That's because we are still wounded. Now, what happens is every time you get uh, shot and then kicked out of a ship, you uh, start bleeding a bit, and then you have to capture yourself. And next time you get kicked out, you have less time. So I think we only have about eight seconds left. So it's a one and done from here on in. But uh, previously, we also managed to uh, manage to steal two ships. Essentially, we did both missions and did them fairly well. We also managed to pick up finally a long-range subverter, which is going to be something very, very useful. In fact, it's mandatory to get. Uh, this mission done. This is the uh, steal the Roma uh, Estante object to make enough money to pay off my wife's debt. Uh, and as you can see, the guards have shields and the bosses have a concussive gun shield and a heat sensor. So, quite frankly, the chances of doing this are very, very, very slim. It's very difficult. We need to get really another subverter. Um, well, ideally we do. So what we're good, what we're going to do essentially is try and do these other missions, and then we'll get a liberation doing. Well, probably doing one of them. Uh, we'll get a liberation, then we'll probably liberate uh, another bit of glitches, or maybe even some sovereign space. Who knows? Either way, let's have a quick look. So this is rescue uh, Collie Horizon and kill no one. Um, it is alarm response 17 seconds we can't kill anyone the guards have a heat sensor and concussive gun bosses have a glitch dash and concussive gun the uh, we have to hijack dust which is many sentry guns lots of guards alarm response stand for five seconds guards have a gun and heat sensor and this guy has glitch dash so actually this one's probably the harder one because of the sentry guns but because of my equipment I think we'll actually be okay that oh, it has lots of guards though um, quite frankly I think we'll go for rescue Corley horizon so we'll accept that and we will have a look. We have to kill no one, so we're gonna we're gonna send the gun to the stash. We'll take the. I really, really want to buy this gun in here. Where is it? This gun. Nope, it's changed. The gun was changed. Um, there was a gun that was like a concussive armor piercing gun, but we only have uh, we only have four armor, uh, AP ammo, so nah. Okay, we'll take the wrench then. We could take another sharp blade, would not work. We've got a key cloner, which is good. Glitch trap, which I've never really I've never used it at all. In fact, look at that. It doesn't even say we've used it. Uh, whereas that we've used eight times. Slipstream we've used once. Uh, the visitor is okay. The high capacity crash beam is very good. The swapper is okay. The subverter is fantastic. Um. Could get rid of the glitch trap um, for what we're doing. For what we're doing, I don't think we really need that, and we will take instead the shield, uh, the stealth shield. So we'll equip the wrench, and the right click will be probably a crash beam just in case, and that'll do it. Right, let's get into the pod and head this way. So, oh god, the best piece of music just come on as well. I just want to drive around, just fly around, moseying about. With the nice music. Anyway, so we have to rescue this. We'll do a bit of a recce first on the ship. This is the... Uh, what space is this? Is it Foundry? It is not Foundry. It is the other guys. Right, so what I figured out what this does. Uh, essentially what you do, if there's, um, it teleports to the closest airlock. Like that. Which sort of makes sense when you read it, but I, I always read it some, some, uh, some other way. Uh, this guy is going to come for me because I, did, I tripped his heat sensors, but it doesn't really matter because there's only him to deal with. He's now being dealt with, and there's a guy in here which is also now being dealt with. And then we'll pick up that body, and then start in the toilet. So whatever this thing is. Is that a toilet? I think it's a toilet, yeah. Oh, no, no it's, it's not a toilet. It's bunks. It's bunks. Right, so we will open this. We have just got a rechargeable visitor. Not too bad. We will send it to the stash and just keep hold of it for now. We need to go over to... Oh, we need to go down there. I can easily, however, take out the... I think we can take out the pilot. And that's always useful because it means that... Ah, oh, crap, they've seen me. Intruder. So they're going to be looking for me now. Not really too bothered, to be honest, because what they're going to do... If they see me, they're only going to shout. They're going to alert people, but quite honestly, as you can see, I'm taking care of business here. There we go. Uh, the, 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 the wrench is um, a fairly useful piece of kit. This is a... What the hell is this? Restockable grenade launcher. I'm looking to restock for free when you return to a friendly station. Cool. That is very, very good. I will just send a stash and we'll keep it for later. So we need to get in there. Um, we could actually get this mission done now. I'm going to... Go through here. Down here. 
in here. Ah, need a level 3 keycard. Right, the nearest level 3 keycard is over this corner. I should be able to do this quite simply then. Go to here, pause it. Rechargeable long range key cloner. Clone that, go in here. Pick them up, and then carry them out. Yeah, I, I, I don't need to take all these out. I do, however, want to take this because it's um, a bit of money. Oh, one, one generic units of currency. Okay, pretty much not worth the effort, but whatever. Um, ah, if I don't get the ship back, will I get these items? That's the question. I don't know. Let's have a quick check. Um, it says... Send a stash when I leave the ship. Okay, right. It says when we leave the ship, so we should be fine then. So we'll get into that, and then we'll just head off. Bye. That was us. That was a oh, that was an off-world, uh, an off-world mission. So this should get us another liberation, and that is good because we are running out of uh, mission variants. It's always just kill no one, and we'll just head in and dock her up and drop her off. There we go. So, Bloodless, Enigma, Silent, Unscathed. There you go. Uh, new Liberation available, so we'll have a quick look. And we can see we've got just more glitches stuff. So, we've got this one here, which is Boost Economy. This one, which is Use High Capacity Teleporters. This one just says more glitches. This one is glitches. This one is Acid Extractor Boost Economy. This one is uh, Unlocks Long Range Glitch Traps. But then we would be able to start going on to Unlock Silent Guns and the Sovereign Cold Fire, whatever that is. Looks like a pod. What I'm going to do is go to the left then. So we will get that and boom. So it's now Beta Bastion in order of Prix's Beta, our character. Long Range Glitch Traps available and that's us. Also, we've now got Audacious Missions. They're the kind that everyone assumes can't be done. They need specialist equipment, meticulous planning, and the capacity to come up with a different me me meticulous plan when your meticulous plan goes catastrophically wrong. They pay very well. Five clients discovered. Okay, good. That's not entirely what I was after here, but whatever, I'll take it. So you can see we've got loads of stuff here. That's fantastic. But um, can we do our main mission? I don't know. Let's have a quick look at the special stock. We've got an overpriced self-charging concussive grenade launcher. That's very good. So it's actually, it's a grenade launch, but it only knocks people down. It doesn't kill them. Okay, fine. Um, I think what I'll do is have a quick look at the missions. We've got our two Audacious missions and a hard one. Uh, the Audacious is Serious Guard Kit. Uh, your characters inspire 75% of normal liberation progress. You're so famous that stories of your success are commonplace. So missions that don't inspire as much liberation progress, those new characters. So if we start a new character, we'd... Um, We'd be able to do it quicker, but obviously we won't have the gear. So that's what it's about, basically. Uh, guards, they've got a shotgun, and this guy's got armor. The bosses have armor. Um, alarm response down 20 seconds, no kills, serious guard kit. This one here is lots of guards, serious guard kit, non-lethal. They have a gun, and they've got a shotgun and armor. Right, so quite frankly, it's just more difficult. I mean, it does pay 20 more. So let's try the audacious one. We'll try this one and see how much we mess it up. So, no kills. It has armor. And... Uh, grenade launcher kills, so we can't take that. Uh, Sidewinder just teleports us somewhere. High capacity visitor. Okay, but we've got... Have we got a rechargeable? We don't. We've got a glitch trap, which we've never used. The rechargeable. We've got a rechargeable visitor. Slipstream is good. We've already got one of those on the on the go there. High capacity visitor. Got the wrench. Got the stealth shield. Long range subverter, yes. Crash beam, yes. I wonder if that works on armor. I, I assume not. No, it's electronic guard kit. Long range visitor. Um... Okay, I think we've got the right gear for this. Let's try it. So, jump in and we'll head off. So this is on Audacious Mission. We have to steal something. Don't know entirely how this is going to go. It looks to be a fairly big ship. Although it's not massive, but it's big enough. So we'll just press F and... Oh, hang on. Uh, no, use. And we teleport to there. So, we will immediately pause it and have a look around. So... This looks clear. Going around, we've got three guards there, one of them with armor. 
Our objective is to steal that. We've got a level 1 there. And... A level 2 keycard there. We need a 2. Where's the nearest 2 keycard? Nearest 2 keycards over there. Okay, I have a plan. And it's a stealth mission, this one. So we're going to be very, very quick and go over here. Pause it. Key clone it. Use that. And we could go down there to see what's in there. I don't think it's... Ooh. Let's risk it. This is a high-capacity stealth shield. I will replace my other one because we've already used it. That guy's gone back, so we don't need to worry about him. Uh, we'll come this way. So, so far, not killed anyone. And we'll be able to get through this door now to here. We'll pause it and clone that guy's key and go straight back out. And then we will... He's using that. We'll quickly rush down and past him. And now we do have a key for this door. That is fine. And down in here. And someone is coming my way. Please don't... Oh, he's going to use that console, I'm guessing. Uh, yes, he is. That's fine. I will wait for him to go. Like that. I will head down and this way to hide. And then I will... I need to get in here. The problem is, I... Don't want the guards coming this way. Oh, he almost saw me. <laughs> right. I need to get in here, but there's also that. I don't think they're going through that area. So what I'll do, I'll get my stealth shield and we'll activate that, which we've now got into here. That's fine. We will then get the crash beam and crash that. We will then go into here. We will steal the thing we're after, which is the concept Mezio object. And we will give it... Uh, oof, ooh, what are we going to do? We'll replace the... Subverter? No, maybe? Key cloner, we don't need that. And the key cloner will be stashed for later on anyway. And the way out is... Probably the back... Probably back where we came, to be quite honest. I'll just wait here. Wait for that guard to come past. And then I'll just go back up. I think that's the best way of doing it. So, activate. Oh, that's the wrong one. Uh, I was trying to crash beam something. It's the stealth shield. Stealth shield. Can't see us because it's, it's directional, which is something I messed up last time. Oh, hang on. That guy's coming. Right, he's going back. That's fine. We'll run this way. And... I think that's a ghost. There we go. We've got the gear. And... That should be us. No one knocked out. No one even saw us. Nowhere near as well. And there we go. Docked up. We'll drop that off and... Boom. We've actually got the Audacity achievement. Look at that. Steal the concept. Messier object. Ghost, 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 silent. Unscathed. So, kill crew, none. Si that's why we got ghost. Crew harmed, none at all. Living witnesses, nothing. Alarms, silent injuries nothing that was good i enjoyed that one nice bit of stealth instead of running around with a wrench and absolutely bringing people over the head with it right so we will take back our key cloner because that's one of the most useful pieces of equipment we have and we'll see what other missions we've got so we've got the uh, capture day prophecy kill no one uh alarm response 34 seconds many sentry guns and guards have a heat sensor and guns. Um, the other one is lots of guards with serious guard kit and 16 second alarm response. So it's a fast ship. Bosses have armor and a shotgun. The guards have a heat sensor but non-lethal weapons. So you have to assassinate one target but kill no one else. I think this one is the better one. Capture someone, even though it's got more sentry guns, because we can turn them off easier. So we'll accept that. And I think we've got the kit for it. Slipstream, yes. Long range visitor, yes. Uh, even though we don't, we've only used it once. Crash beam, very useful. Subverter, going to be useful as well. Stealth shield, we've got there. What I'm going to do, actually, I'm going to swap out uh, our stealth shield here. I don't want to. Um, I don't want to have two stealth. She fails with just like one usage, it'll be annoying. There's the breaker, uh, Gemini. You can actually talk to them and get bits of story, but um, for now, I think we will.
jump back in the pod and head off. So another audacious mission. Only going to inspire, I think it was 57 or 59 percent of uh, the original. Let's use that and teleport to there. Uh, only inspire a little bit of the. Uh, Liberation progress. This is someone coming over here. This is fine because what we can do is pause it. We will get ourselves a I could get a subverter and that nah, I sorry. I can't use a subverter. I was gonna say I'll use a subverter to oh, we can't do that either I was gonna use a subverter to uh, Subvert that gun, but then that'll kill everybody and we can't do it not on this mission. So what we'll do instead is Clone that guy's key and what we'll do, pause it and actually look around. So, loads of stuff around here. Very, very difficult to go this way. So, we're probably going to ignore that. The thing we need is over this corner and it's capture that person. So, actually what we can do is probably get in there, blow the window and just pick them up with the pod. It sounds dangerous and that's because it is. But we should be okay. Keycard number two over there. So, if we sneak this way, we should be alright. Okay, that's fine. What I'll do then is I will uh, get my stealth field and I will activate it. Go through. They didn't see me. This way. And then we're in here. And now we've got the sentry gun looking at me with another guard. And it does look like they're going to come through this way. That's fine. Wait until that's turned around, which it's now doing. I will then get my crash beam and I want to go... In and I want to turn that off, which I've now done. I will quickly run up here, pause it, get myself the key clone once more, steal that guy's key. We will. Oh, this is probably this is difficult because that guy's the pilot. I'm gonna have to go through him to take the rest out. That's not too much of a problem. We can just go in and bang. There's the pilot gone. I don't think anyone comes this way, or at least I hope not. Um. The other person we need is, or the person we do need is there now, they've moved. So, we can either wait, or we can have a look. I'm going to go down here because I want to try and, sub I want to get rid of that gun. So, I'll see if I can crash beam the gun. That's now crash beamed. Heat sensor is now crash beamed, and the other heat sensor is now crash beamed. So, that neither of those heat, uh, heat sensors work, so they're not going to be able to detect me. I should then be able, if they're going this way, which is that's exactly what they're doing, uh, is knock them out and then... Uh, open that. Now, here's a bit of a problem here. Um, how am I going to do this? I don't have a glitch trap. A glitch trap, I'd be able to teleport them out into space. I, however, do have a... I've got a visitor. Mm. Okay, what I'll do, I'll just wait until they use this console and then I'll knock them out and think about the, think the rest of it. So I'll pick them up. Carry to pod. Pausing it. Um, ah, looks like we're going to have to drop them first. Okay, so we'll remote control the pod. And we will go to the front here. Oh, crap. This one right in front, look. Stop, control stop remote controlling that. Take them out. Uh, quite honestly, just because I don't want this guy to come around and see me, I'll take him out. And the pod's slowly drifting off. What I need to do, I need to get the ship on a constant bearing. I will... Oh, is it? Um, we'll put, that, put the pod there. Come on. Right, pod should be fine. Pod's outside. Oh, it's only just outside. Pick up the target. Bring them here. This is not going to work. I'm picking this guy up. The reason for that is if I blow this window and he's still there, we might have a bit of a problem there. Um, back to the pod. Just back over a little bit, please. Just edge down a bit. As close as we're going to get it. There we go. Stop. Right. So. Pick up the gun. And... Well, here we go. I have blown myself out of the window. Uh, we've got... Nah, I'm, I'm going over there, but my capture target is going... What? Where is the target for me to be cap... Where is it? They're not inside that, are they? Okay, I'm going to have to... 
pick my body up. This is problematic. Uh, did they stay inside? Don't think they're moved. Okay, let's try that again. Hang on. Yeah, they didn't get sucked out the airlock. Damn it! Okay. Looks like we're going to have to go around all this again. Shouldn't be a problem. I thought it would, the body would have got, uh, would have been sucked out, but it was not. So, still shield. On and around. Like I say, it shouldn't be too much of a difficult task to get them. I mean, I've cl pretty much cleared the entire way. Um, the question is, can we just dra Actually... Um... That's not something I wanted. Uh, we're now under attack. Okay. Better way of doing this. Straight out the airlock. Right, so. <laughs> we just walked straight out of that shield. Remote control the pod, because we're under attack. And, oh god, that was a missile! And I've just failed the mission. Well, I've failed part of the mission because a crew member's died. Wasn't to do with me, though. I didn't do any of that. It was just under attack. I don't know whether that's classed as a quirk of the game or whether it's just a genuine bug because that's happened a couple of times when I've failed a mission, or rather failed part of it, because someone's died because it was under attack, um, but I didn't kill them. But I don't know whether that's supposed to be uh, the game. We'll drop them off. Crew killed two. That wasn't me. I didn't kill it. I don't know whether the, the person who's giving me the contract, like, I don't know if it's supposed to be canon, like, well, actually, someone did die while you were there, so it's your fault. Even though it wasn't. But either way, we managed to do that. Enigma and Silent. Um, interesting mission, although we got very little pay because of, well, someone died. And, yeah, I think we will leave it there for this episode. Uh, what I want to do is get another liberation so we can get different missions and then see what those offer because at the moment it's just the sort of stealthy ones and these audacious ones. Although, I think we are doing them. The last couple of missions have been sort of very violent, but, uh, sorry, the last couple of missions have been very stealthy, whereas the previous ones have been violent. I hope we get one that uh, changes that up again. Either way, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.